Hello, um, so this week's Ask the Coach question, we're uh, addressing Brian Quinn's question here. He says, uh, struggling with my diet, any suggestions for a fussy eater? Uh, well, Brian, um, not a lot of information to go on there, but let's just address two things in a kind of a general way here. Uh, the first one there you mentioned was struggling with your diet. The way we look at this for everybody who's uh, struggling with any, any goal they have, or anything that's supposed to bring them closer to their goal, is for you to decide exactly what your goal is. So if you're kind of struggling with your diet, like, oh, you know, I want to eat well and I want to lose fat or I want to gain muscle or whatever it is, but I just keep reverting to eating uh, pizza and junk food and everything else, you really have to examine what exactly your goal is and what exactly your behavior is. And um, we take this from the one minute manager. They have this idea that if your goals match your behaviors, you're doing fine, keep going. But if your goal does not match your behavior, you need to look at either changing your behavior or changing your goal. And both of those is fine, by the way. Um, but, you know, if your goal is, for example, lose fat, and your behavior is you're eating pizzas or you're doing something else like that, you have to re-examine, is this really your goal? You know, or, and, you know, how much do you care about it, or do you actually want to achieve this? And then, once you've decided you want to achieve it, everything you do becomes filtered through that. It's not like you're denying yourself the pizza, it's you're eating the salmon and slivered almonds and broccoli and, you know, garlic and olive oil because you want to achieve your goal. So that's uh, thing number one. Uh, thing number two there is being a fussy eater. Um, really easy cure for this is just try new stuff. So uh, I would set yourself the goal of trying two new meals per week. There is a brilliant website called thefoodie.com that we'll post up in the comments. I'll just show you guys a quick look at it here. Um, there's a whole 30 approved section on here. So these are all uh, head to toe legit paleo meals. There are approximately 900 of these things on here. So um, even if you are the fussiest eater on the planet, there is bound to be at least 20 of them that you'd like. And that's enough meals to build a nice varied week around. So you gotta get out there and find them, unfortunately. Uh, so get in there, dig in, flick through, find what you like the look of, learn to cook it, buy the ingredients, try it out. Next week, try two more. Week after that, try two more. Save the ones you like, and, uh, well, there you go. Just expand the palate a little bit, step by step. And also, learn new ways to prepare the existing meals. So maybe, you know, you've decided you don't like broccoli when it's steamed. Well, maybe try it roasted with a little olive oil. Maybe try it sautéed with garlic and balsamic vinegar. Try different ways to cook the food that you do like. And let's see if we can kind of bring this one out a little bit. All right.